anyone he think he is super, supreme, he is risk for humanity. Just to show you how Putin he think, how Putin he follows the steps of Muhammad. This is how Putin believe. He is a Muhammadan. He is following the filthy Muhammad. Muhammad told the Muslims, you are the best nation ever for mankind. Putin, he think, he is the best for mankind. He himself, not only, he's not talking about the Russian, he himself, he is the best man. So the Muslims, the Muhammadan, they've been taught that they are the best people ever, ever, ever. Supremacist. The Arab supremacist. And look here, it says between two brackets, the benefit. Okay, what the benefit? You see the Muslim, they try to make it look nicer. They say the benefit for mankind. And this is Quran chapter 3, verse 110. How that is explained? The best for mankind are those who bring them with the chains around their necks till they embrace Islam. Do you see it? Putin, Vladimir, Hitler, Putin, Muhammad. He is doing a benefit for mankind. The Ukrainian, they are lost. And he want to correct them. He want to save them, brother. So he will bring them with the chains around their neck. For he believed that he is a supreme person. He will bring them. He will make them embrace his religion, which is money and dollar and sex and the child molester Muhammad and Kadarov. This is the truth. Anyone who support killing of innocent, doesn't matter who, if you support killing of Rus Russian women and children, you are a criminal. If you support killing Ukrainian, you are a criminal. If you support even killing Muslims, women and children, you are a criminal. Doesn't matter who you support, as long as the victims are victims, you are a criminal. Mustafa Jabbar, you are a Muslim, but you don't answer what I'm showing you in the screen. You are a potato, get out of here. Believe in the West is sad. So why you don't say to me how sad you are to see your prophet saying that you coward? Believe in the West is sad. You know, I like it when the Muslim, they play dumb. <laughs> Believe in the West is sad. You know what? In, uh, in Islamic countries, belief there is so good. Let me show you some of the beliefs in the, in the Middle East. And that will make you feel better, brother. Okay? As you know, I'm a Middle Eastern. And I miss really the Middle East. I really miss it. You know? I'm going to go and have fun. In the Middle East, we have a lot of religious people. I mean, religion is dripping from the ass of every Middle Eastern in the Middle East. Prostitution, belly dancing, drugs. Like some videos blocked by YouTube. You cannot click on them because you have to confirm your age. <laughs> brother, is that the Middle East, brother? I just type one word. Uh, drugs party, sex parties, women sleeping at the top of each other in public, having sex, performing sex in public. My brother, may Allah ask you. My brother, are they praying or their ass is up for different reason? Can you explain to me why their ass is up? What is that? Shall I play the video for you? Okay, let me play the video for you. Hold on. I want to be sure that's not too much bad, you know, just for security sec reason. Oh, look at this, mashallah, mashallah. Yeah, this one we can show. It's not too bad. 
Okay. Are you ready? You know, Europe is full of filth, brother. Brother? We are holy people. We are very holy people. Okay. Uh, uh, holy people. Mashallah, mashallah. Look how fast they shake, brother. Who can do that? I challenge you. How you what is that? Man, oh man. Okay, stop here. That's enough. Because now that will offend Putin. Putin, he did not teach them to do it this way. He was asking them to move to the other direction. Please, somebody contact them. Do you think those asses are the same ones who voted for Putin yesterday? Brother? Hmm? I'm trying to show, to find something is not, you know, will not hurt our eyes. Hmm. Okay, no, this is too much. Actually, even YouTube blocked a lot of them. You have to confirm your age. You know? Hmm. Yeah, all of them, they are blocked. You cannot even click. You have to confirm. I'm not, I'm not using it like I did not log in in this page to be able to uh, to uh, to see them. Yeah, alhamdulillah. Alham aman Rabbi, aman. Aman Rabbi, aman. Erdogan, he eat Roman. Hmm. Yeah, nothing good to show. It's very bad. <coughs> We are trying to find you something fit with your age. According to Islam, if you are six years old and older, you are an adult. Oh, what is that? MashaAllah, MashaAllah. Amar Rabbi, Amar. I'm thinking to convert to Islam right now. MashaAllah, MashaAllah. What is that, brother? Brother, is that double? Is that double floor dancing? Is that a sex dancing? And usually they sleep in the top of each other and they shake like that, having sex, you know, in the front. And look, the men, and oh, look at the shakes around. Look at the shake, brother. Unbelievable, brother. And listen carefully. They are wearing hijab. We have to be honest here. Very conservative. They are wearing hijab. Okay? What this guy is doing? He is kissing her. Good. And look how her ass can move so fast. How many of you is jealous now? Huh? How many of you? <laughs> I know. You are jealous, kuffar, infidel. And this is what Zakir Naik call it halal fun. <laughs> You know, Zakir Naik, when he said, you cannot have fun, only halal fun. And look how he screamed. Like he was so excited to answer the question. Okay, you can have only halal fun. Ah, halal fun, Amar Rabbi Amar. Stand. The brothers asked a very important question that most of the scholars say that listening to music, watching movies, and most of the television programs, they're haram. So how can we have fun? Let me tell you, brother, at the outset, that having fun is permitted in Islam as long as the fun is halal fun. Hey, can you elaborate, brother? <laughs>